Hi there ladies and gents, going out on a new trip and as you can see the weather is pretty miserable uh, it's gonna rain, I'm just finished at work and uh, it's gonna rain the whole day it's now three o'clock and I'm uh, heading off for the weekend so I will tell you a little bit more that after the intro but I think we're in for a wet one roll intro Back on the road, and uh, as you can see, <laughs> it's a pretty grey day. It's been raining all day, just finished at work, and uh, I think I'm going to have rain all the way up to where I'm going today. And the place I'm going to is Beitostel, because the plan this weekend is to ride some of the tents in Norway. Looked at the weather forecast before I left and it looks a hell of a lot better tomorrow and on Sunday so I'm gonna ride the pieces of section, sections 1 and 2 and uh, oh, oh hi. actually the sun is out briefly but uh, it rained heavily back home when I left but it stopped so I jumped on the bike but I think the rain that was in Kongsberg we're gonna get up in Numadar again so yeah, I got a pretty long stint now up to Gorn and uh, then we're gonna go over Gornsfjell I think and then look on the tent. So yeah, let's hope it's gonna be a great ride and a fun afternoon night. And I went to the cabin this time, I went to the cabin tonight and tomorrow because uh, oh, I'm getting old. I think it's a little bit too cold to use a tent in August in Norway. So uh, yeah. Let's crack on! Ah oh, shit, the sky is even greyer <laughs> over there. <laughs> oh, I'm running into very bad weather! Brace yourself, Thomas! I think it's gonna be pretty wet in a while. Doesn't look good at all. But it's only today, only today, it's much better tomorrow than uh, it's tomorrow that counts because then we're going on the tent. If the weather is pretty bad when we get to Gore, I'm not going to ride over Gore's weather. We'll see how bad it is. But uh, we're going into very bad weather. Now I've chosen the adventure route on the Garmin, so uh, it's taking me all over the place. <laughs> Yeah, but I've rented a big cabin tonight. It's a cabin for five people. And, uh, it wasn't anything else available. So yeah, I just did it because I didn't want to stay in a tent in this weather. And uh, tomorrow I'm uh, having a small cabin at Grimsby. So the plan is to ride the uh, Jotunheim wagon and uh, we're going to do uh, Grimstar and Iundarn, we're gonna, uh, if the weather stays pretty nice, we're gonna go up to Bloha. And uh, I've never been on that section of the tent in Norway, so I'm really looking forward to it. And I'm all alone, but uh, I got my mascot with me this time, because that was the deal with my two daughters. If I wanna uh, go this weekend, I have to take Nigel. Nigel is with me. I hope you liked the uh, last vids that I put out, especially the, the vid when we are going up to Kalholm. That was a magical day. We have to get time to go up there again before winter comes. Other than that, give us a like, subscribe to my channel, ding the bell. I think I'm gonna stop in Gur. Have some coffee in my backpack. 
some energy bars then I'm gonna make myself a uh, pasta at my cabin the full equipped cabin with showers full kitchen everything so a little bit of luxury tonight we got to remember to buy beer that's the most important thing oh the joy of riding in the rain oh adventure the sky has fallen down it's been raining a lot and uh, I just had to stop I got water running in my pants I think <laughs> now I'm pretty happy that I'm not camping tonight I'm gonna warm cozy cabin I can dry my clothes have a warm shower oh. but it's raining a lot I couldn't see anything a little bit of traffic lots of water in the road so I just have to stop for a minute because oh, I actually have water running in my pants <laughs> so yeah I'll take a break here and see if it gets a little bit lighter but uh, I think it's going to rain heavy for a while now so yeah maybe we just had to go go to Gord and get out to buy stern and we will see if I will do Gordsfjellet and turn on the tet today I don't know but in this weather I'm just going to go straight to the campsite at by stern so after I left Hagerbu I had to put the cameras away because it didn't stop to rain and uh, when I put it on again I lost the audio so uh, that's a bummer but I decided to go over Gorsfjellet and I'm gonna leave you here with some music and some clips from my ride over Gorsfjellet and uh, you'll pick me up again when we get to the campsite at Beidstøl because I got some audio back enjoy made it so uh, let's I will find out what cabin we have mm -hmm. finally we're here and uh, I don't know what I'm gonna do now I'm going to have myself a beer. This was a very wet ride, but um, got to ride Gorsfjellet, so a little bit of gravel, so nice. But now, sit down on that chair and have a beer. Well deserved, yeah. Yeah, finally dinner. And on tonight's menu is noodles. So, um, not that much content today because of very bad weather. So, uh, it's soon 9 o'clock in the evening. So, I'm just gonna finish up my meal, have a few beers, and uh, I'm gonna watch the Olympics. But uh, tomorrow we are hitting the Tet. So, I'm really looking forward to that. And the weather outside <laughs> will be much better tomorrow. There's hardly any rain tomorrow. And on Sunday there's sun all day. So I think we're going to have a couple, um, couple of good days. 
but uh, that means also that this is the end of today's vid. Mm. So, if you like today's video, give this video a like. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel and uh, ding the notification bell. My name is Thomas, Simple Guy on Two Wheels. See you in the next one. Bye. Oh, this was so good. Mm. Oh, best sound in the world.